Hi everyone and uh, welcome to lecture number 8 in Terraform for Cloud Engineers series. In the last lecture we discussed about uh, what is a resource block, how it looks like, what is the syntax and few things related to uh, HashuCorp uh, HCL basics. In this video we're gonna cover or we're gonna discuss about uh, local file or local provider in Terraform and how you can create a file locally in Windows, for example, using Terraform uh, local file resource type or Terraform local file resource as such. So let's get started. Let me go into my Terraform folder. And I've created a new folder over here called as Terraform script and let me open uh, Visual Studio. Visual Studio Code and let me open the folder which is like Terraform scripts okay and we're gonna discuss about local file or local provider so let's create another folder inside it which is like local file resource I've given just a name over here and let's create a configuration file uh, under this folder which is like main.tf where we'll do the actual configuration and let me show you the Terraform registry and let's say local file Terraform resource once we click on it it should open the Terraform registry page, page with this uh, local file or, or local provider as such local provider is used to manage local resources such as files so using Terraform you can create a file locally and let's go to documentation and if you click on those resource we see we have two resources under local provider. One is local underscore file, local underscore sensitive file. So this is just like if you want to create a file locally um, without a sensitive content, then you can use this local underscore file. And if you have a sensitive content inside the file, then you can use this local underscore sensitive file. So as you could see, local underscore sensitive underscore file generates a local file with given sensitive content. So let's try to discuss about local file first um, and let's go to example usage from over here and if you could see this is the code uh, for creating a file and a putting a content inside it so <clears throat> let me write it from my end so I'll just say resource and we gonna use local underscore file as a resource type and let's give a name to this resource block you can give any name like locally or let's give like tf example local you can give any name to this resource as such that's not an issue and let's see which are all arguments uh, we have inside this and if you go to example usage and uh, if we see this file name is required parameter and there are few other optional parameter like which content and other things like file permission by default it's zero triple seven and few other things so let's give the required argument first like file name we can give file name like learning df dot txt and now we need to define the content which we need to put inside this txt file learning or maybe Terraform with GCP and I think our code is almost ready these are all 
uh, like the important parameters. And if I go to my terminal, and right now I am under in this Terraform scripts folder. I'm not into the local underscore file folder. So if I hit Terraform in it, it will not work because I am in the in, into this Terraform script folder and there is no TF file as such. And let's see it in action. It says Terraform initialized in an empty directory. There is no Terraform configuration file. You may begin working with Terraform immediately. So actually our scripts or file configuration file are under this folder. So let's go to this folder and try to run Terraform in it so that it can download the provider plugin and initialize the working directory. So it says Terraform has been successfully initialized. Quite very good. Let's say Terraform plan to see what's gonna happen. So it will say like Terraform will do the create uh, thing for us. Terraform will perform the following action. It will create a local file resource, as you could see, and this is the name for that resource uh, as such. And if you could see the content is Terraform with GCP, which we have given over here. And these are all few are the optional fields uh, or default one, which gets added like directory permissions and file permissions. File name is the one which we have given, learning tf.txt. And uh, once we hit Terraform apply, you will see a text file is created and under this local file and we, we will have these log files and other things created which we have already discussed. And if I hit Terraform apply, you see it is asking me to enter a confirmation, right? And let's say, suppose uh, you don't want this confirmation to be popped up always. So we do have like a way for this. Uh, I have a I've canceled the apply and this time I will say Terraform apply dash auto dash approve and that prompt will not come. It will directly apply. So if you see plan one to add zero to change and apply complete. Yeah, this time we haven't received that prompt for the confirmation as such. So uh, let's see if we have the txt file being created. So if you could see this is the txt file and this is the content um, which is there. And this is the state file log.hcl file with the version of the prior plugin. And it will create a .terraform folder. This we have already discussed. If you haven't seen my previous video, I will request you to watch that. And um, what I wanted to show you is uh, we just discussed about the local file resource, right? And let's say, suppose um, right now in the Terraform plan, we can see the content of the file. And let's say, suppose if it's a sensitive content for you. So then uh, what we can do is we can make use of this resource and uh, let's see the example usage. It says resource and this is the resource type and resource name and file name is required and content is string and sensitive. So let's go over here. Uh, let's first put the resource type local underscore sensitive underscore file. Let me copy it. Yeah, and let's give a different name, TF sensitive. And <clears throat> this time, let's say, let's give a different file name. File name is Terraform with GCP. And content is, let's give a different content. I'm learning Terraform with GCP. Let's save the file and let's say Terraform plan to see what happens. Now it says one to add, zero to change and one to destroy. Destroy will be the previous one which we have created which is local underscore file resource type as you could see there. Yeah. This will be destroyed. Local underscore file will be destroyed. And the local underscore sensitive underscore file dot tf sensitive will be created. 
and if you could see previously that content was shown in the previous example but if you could see we are using this local underscore sensitive file generates local file with the given sensitive content so the content is hidden or not shown over here in the plan because that's the purpose of this resource block and this is the file name tf with gcp and let's do the form apply dash auto dash prove so that we don't get that prompt it says apply complete resource one added one is destroyed and let's see uh, in the local file folder if our new file is created this was the file name to have found with gcp and this is the content so um i hope this video was informative and just thought to show you like how we can create a local file using terraform and i'll see you in the next um, because this was also pending i didn't complete it in the last video so i thought like okay let's start with this resource block and then um, move ahead with the other resource block so i'll see you guys in the next video with another resource block or we will try to see how we can create multiple um, resources using terraform uh, main.tf file and uh, so on so thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next